Hello and welcome to the Switch Underground, my name is Danny and today we're going to take a look at Ori and the Blind Forest, the Definitive Edition demo came out Friday. If this comes out on Friday, cool, if not, it is September 20th. Now, this game is the result of Microsoft and Nintendo playing nice, which is why we got stuff like Cuphead, and uh, now we're getting this, and this is really popular. People have loved this game, and I've never played it. And it looks amazing. We shall always remember the night when I lost Ori to the great storm. Music's so peaceful, dude. Looks amazing. I hope everybody's having a great day today. As it is the 20th, today's Link's Awakening Day, dude. Mine will be coming to me via UPS at some point. It's also the Trine 1, 2, and 3 collection from GameStop. Oh, I thought he was going to talk. And the Goose Game, and this whole September thing just keeps going, dude. Who's that? Oh, it's me. Oh, it is me. Okay, so I can jump. Can't run very fast, can't relate. So far, this game is way too close to home. That's fine. All right, so we're moving through the storm here. It's a swallow's nest. That's a very hollow nighty looking. Can't do anything but walk. That piano though. And there's a little feather. Get it, dude. So which one's Ori? When Naru embraced my light. Oh, he's got himself a little creature. I like that. As a child of her own. Dude, this looks awesome. Runs decent, controls are tight-ish. Doesn't feel like they're as tight as they could be. Ori, if this is Ori, he's a little floaty. So I can just jump around, that's it. Nothing, buttons don't do anything, so we're just moving around. Uh, obviously we're in 2D platforming mode. Oh. Dude, I kinda need to turn this up. Hold on. Yeah, dude. I like that. Okay, we're turned up. What's up, man? Shake that tree. It's like a Lilo and Stitch vibe. So we're putting X's on the trees. This has got some good feels, man. Ooh, wow. I'm gonna eat all that shit. Not before we build a bridge. Just casually constructing a bridge. We're engineers, it's fine. Have a little water. So what is that like? My caretaker? Something bad's gonna happen. I can feel it. Here it comes, dude. Oh, I can move. Uh, I'm just gonna hop over here with my stuff. Clearly not supposed to go that way, that's fine. But you know video games, you never know what you can find when you go off the beaten path. On that fateful night. When I lit the skies ablaze. called out to Ori. So is this like God talking to me here? Uh oh. I'm 
Mama Bear doesn't want me looking at the Sky God guy. All the fruit's gone, dude. Yet hope never came. So it looks like... Oh, there's some fruit. Pick it up, dude. Might be the last one. Or not. Looking pretty grim out here. Couldn't we have just rolled with the strong start? Things were so happy. Through the passage of time. Oh, there's some dude. Life withered and decayed. When the forest was blind. Eat up, little guy. I've eaten my fair share. Let me up there, dude. I can do it. There's a whole bushel. Still, hope showed its face. Alright, let's go. No way. No, 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 no. Get up. Oh boy. Okay. Why? Why does a game want to make you cry in the first uh, ten minutes? It's messed up, man. I've had an emotional week. I can't deal with this. <clears throat> Crap. I should have played the goose game first. Like that. This is some what's eating Gilbert grape shit, dude. Don't like it. Mama, wake up. Mm. Okay, well, um, that was like seeing, you know, up for the first time. An orphan once more. With no reason to stay. Can't even jump. Searching for my light. So weak and so frail. Come on, baby. We can do it. When cries were met with silence. There's red stuff here. Looks scary, dude. Tippy toe. And hope went astray. Oh, 
Uh oh. Come on, Sky Dude. When my child's strength faltered. Keep growing. I don't know where we're going. Dear old dad could have interjected at any time here. Didn't really need these splinters on the belly, you know? And the last breath was drawn. Oh, we're dead. Well, that's great. This is a unique experience, dude. Big ass tree. My light revived, Ori. A new age had dawned. And we're back. Got an achievement. Oh. Wow, I got speed. Got speed. Lots of jumpies. Okay. Ooh. Um, well that was it. Okay, that hurt. That hurt a little bit. Can I jump in these at all? A little... Okay. Nope. No, okay. We're dying. All right. Didn't really need to do that, but whatever. Oh, push B to jump higher. Okay, can I climb this wall? Well, I'm pushing B to jump higher, but it, I don't really have much new height, dude. Okay. We got up there. That's gonna hurt, right? Oh, of course. This looks like a secret. Give me that secret mushroom. Nope, not there. Oh, what's that? You found a small spirit light -like container. Spirit light has been added to your circle. Find more spirit light -like containers to quickly gain ability points. Really, ability points? Okay. So, I mean, once again, I know absolutely nothing about this dude, but so far, I'm super glad I went into a blind. Uh, what's this? Whoa. You found a life shard. Collect these to restore your vitality. Okay, so there's going to be some RPG elements. That's cool. Can I swing from the fruit here? Nope, just a, just a normal ass little swinging plant there. You found an energy cell. You can now collect and use more energy. Remember that you can use energy to create a soul link and save your game. Push A to create a soul link and save your game. Oh wow, so I need... I have to use energy to actually like put my save points. That seems annoying, but that's okay. We're here for a unique experience and that's why we did that. Alright, 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 alright. That's why we did that. Okay, bring it on, dude. I'm ready. Come on, bust this open. Let's go, turd. Psych. Just kidding. Come here. Oh, but you got me, didn't you? All right, one more turn. Come on. I'm ready. Come on. Right up on the wall, dude. I'm ready. Come here. Yoink. Late a bit. Sorry. I meant to say, uh, thank you for your kind assistance. This game's gorgeous, dude. And here I was like, deep in the forest where he found what was lost. Here I was thinking like I would just be like enamored with trying, but ooh, Soul Link is ready. Okay, should I, I should do it here, right? Well, let's grab this first.
didn't access the ability tree. But that's okay. My strength is returning. I am seen the light in the eyes of the spirit tree. I was lost in this glen when she loosened her grip. I can guide you on your journey if you'll allow me to come. Be still. Can you hear that? They must have followed you here. I didn't make a soul link, dude. Ah, crap. Let's make one real quick. Okay, good. Spirit flame. Ready? Ooga fire. Let's go. Oh my god, I can fight. Awesome. What do you get when people die? Maybe I should try to use some of those ability points real quick before we get cracking. Wait. There it is. Flames. Spirit magnet. Rekindle. Ooh. This is awesome. Triple jump? Holy crap. Water... Br okay. There's a lot of good stuff here. Wow, see-through walls? So we have flames. Magnety stuff. Oh, dude. This is... This is cool. Allows reusing soul links and shortens the cooldown timer. Probably gonna need that. Yeah, we'll take that one. I don't know... I don't know how that's supposed to work, but whatever. Let's go kick some ass here real fast. What's up, fella? Wow, dude, that thing... I need those. Their light shall return to me. These words the spirit tree once said. In the glade past the caverns, we'll find him. There's a path up ahead. Okay. <gasps> no, I didn't grab my shit. One percent on the hollow grave. So I'm here. There's my soul link stuff. That's where I need to be. Zoom, zoom out. Oh my gosh, dude, this place is. This is a cool map. Okay, so what am I supposed to do now? Oh, find the spirit tree. Okay. Actively finding the spirit tree. Thank you, God, I don't have to find a map maker. And I can destroy those things. Dude. It's simple, but I can already tell it's going to have some crazy stuff that's happening. So does this use energy? I don't see anything depleting when I use this. Do I? Like, even my yellow stuff? Oh. Definitely gonna want stuff to float to me. Come on, dude. Okay. Nasty spiky dude. Ouch. Can't hit that. Can I? No. I can destroy all of this nasty crap, though. What's in there? Ooh, a bouncy boy. Wow. That's actually pretty damn satisfying. Spirit wells are ancient structures that were used to quickly traverse all of Nebel. The light of the spirit wells will also replenish your strength whenever you are weary. Cool. A bench. There's gonna be a lot of uh Ooh, and, and it's a warp. This game did it right, dude. It feels like Monster Boy meets Hollow Knight. And I realize this came before all of those. I'm just going by what it feels like to me from what I know, dude. Alright, man. Well, I mean that's the first 20 minutes. But uh, let's just go a little bit further, see if we can actually... Oh, there we go. Oh god, that, those guys hurt. Gotta watch the health, dude. I already got... 
Can I get up there? What is that thing? I need that. I need that. 100% for secrets. They just opened... Oh god, that hurt. Okay. We definitely need some health now. Maybe there's some in here. Okay, we cannot get hit by that thing. <gasps> now we can. Okay. Okay. An energy shard. Ooh, good. That means I can make a I can make a savey boy. Push ZR to grab and move objects. Okay. Oh, there we go. Okay. Got it. You found a keystone. Keystone are used to open spirit gates. Remember that each spirit gate will require a different number of keystones. What's a spirit gate, dude? Oh! That scared the crap out of me. Okay, how do I fight this guy and not get hit? That is what I want to know. Okay, I'm kind of curious what's down there, but not at the same time. Okay. We needed that. This is the spirit gate. Okay. It needs two. The spirit gates block us. They were built for protection before the days of decay. The required keystones must be nearby. To reach the spirit tree, we must pass the spirit caverns that lie beyond this gate. Nailed it. First try. Just jumping over here real quick, see if there's anything. Yep. Should I make a save thingy? I mean, we gotta be close to a spirit well, right? Okay. So can I... Okay, that was unnecessary. Ooh, look at this. Spirit Caverns and Hollow Grove. I think we want to go Spirit Caverns, right? Oh god, no, dude. Not good. Should have made a save. Point. Crap. Alright, well, we died. That is an intro to Ori in the Blind Forest, the definitive, definitive, definitive edition, and this game looks freaking awesome, dude. I really hope this gets a physical release. Between this and Blasphemous, as soon as you start to think that you're kind of sick of platformers, they go and do stuff like this. Man, what a cool experience this is going to be. I mean, the emotional stuff in like the first two seconds. Okay, okay, okay. So we get in, take some hits, and get the heck out. Alright, let's just grab our little spirit key again. Just to see what's beyond. I bet we could make it to the caverns, dude. I bet we could. We'll try. Okay. Oh. I mean, it all just kind of feels really nice. It's like indie, but not at the same time. Yeah, we got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. I don't know how I feel about voices like that, though. It would have been nice for it to be voice acted. The sound things, I mean, it's okay. But it does kind of bug you sometimes. We have an ability point, though. Hey, I'm trying to make a... How come I can't make a thing? There it is, dude. Okay, I can have ability. Create a soul link. Creating a soul link restores one life cell. Now, let's do this. Allows you to shoot three flames before recharging. Okay. What does that mean? I don't think that's helping me. Okay, that one got me again. Spirit Caverns, yes. Man, I could use like a dodge or a dash. Soul Link is ready again. Hey, we're in the Spirit Caverns. Sweet. Where's my teleporty? Ooh, there's another spirit gate. Alright, I really gotta stop playing this now. So, we're gonna kill these dudes, see what's beyond. Dude, I love my little guy here. Is that candle? Video games? Nope. Smack that one. 
Oh, we're just eating that. I mean, everything feels pretty good to blow up. There's just something about a nice bassy explosion. It just feels good, dude. All right, map. Do I have the map? No, oh no, but there's... Okay, showing us places to explore. Okay, there's a little path boy down here. We're gonna jump down here and then we're done, I swear. Oh no, not you. Key down here. Spirit well, there it is, dude. Oh. This is a map stone, one of many ancient markers created to chart the forest of Nebel as it grew. There's a piece missing. If we can find the map stone fragment, we might be able to repair it. Do I- oh, do I have one? I don't think I have one. Is that it? That looks like the key, dude. Oh, I don't, I don't, okay. Well, we got a key. Well, it looks like we do need the dang map things, just like in Hollow Knight, dude. Well, hopefully it's a little easier than Hollow Knight. Is that guy respawning? Looks like it. Yep. Alright, so you know, it's your standard operating procedure here. Um, I'm okay with it. I mean, you gotta have something to do. You can't just run through everything once and then be like, alright, no more enemies, that's fine. Uh-oh. Soul Link is ready again. I can't jump up there. Maybe there's a, a bouncy boy? Oh, we're just falling down everything here. Dude, it is nice that I can just shoot stuff from everywhere. Ouch, missed that one. Uh, should have specced into that floating ability. This is a bouncy boy, it's gotta be. It's not. Crap, I'm missing so much stuff. Alright, we are definitely specking into... Oh, those are just experience orbs, okay. Next time we get a point, we're specking into that magnet stuff. There it is, dude. Alright, soul link time. Ability. Magnet. Perfect. We are officially fully upgraded to tier 1. Alright. I can keep going. So this game comes out on the 27th of September. Which, you know, part of everything else you want to buy in September. So. If you're a big fan of this game... Let me know how you think it's working on the Switch, and if you're going to get it. If you've never even heard of this game before, uh, like me, uh, are you going to get it? I mean, it looks pretty dang cool, and it's cheap. It's like 20 bucks, dude. And you can go download the demo. This was off the NAE shop. Try it out for yourself, dude. It feels good. And I'm looking forward to it. Be good to each other, and I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.